<sighs> you know, it's it's kind of weird to see right now. Because as soon as the stream ends, the first one, uh, now Essay's DMing me. Well, that's nice. He's DMing me. So as soon as as soon as the stream starts, <laughs> now he's now he's apparently he just woke up. Okay, I'm gonna put this down. I mentioned this on stream. I'm gonna tell him in DMs. I'm gonna tell him in DMs that uh, uh, we'll do it. I guess tonight, probably at a later time, or whatever the fuck. I guess why not have another stream. But it'll be late. Be a little late. I might have to sleep a little early so I can wake up on time and do it. <laughs> he has a more fucked up sleep schedule than I do. I thought I had one, but no. <laughs> he tops it. Well, that's nice. That's nice. Now, unfortunately, because I don't have this set up all too properly... I don't think I'm able to, like, see the stream chat while I'm playing, unfortunately. So. Kind of sucks. I guess it doesn't really matter. Yeah, <laughs> I'm streaming right now. I was. He didn't show up. Because I, I'm not, I'm tired of fucking waiting on this guy. Told him the time, everything. Didn't show up. So whatever. And it's getting late for me anyway. So. <laughs> okay. Well I guess we'll do it tonight then. Gave you time. Didn't show up. That's on you. I told you days ago. Don't call me a fucking brainlet. I didn't graduate from Harvard with a degree in fucking DoorDash. Sorry. <laughs> it's not me. But since I already have this set up, I'll go ahead and continue on. Just play. It's fine. I'm sure you can see his DMs. I don't know if you can or not. But we'll play a little bit. I won't play super long. A medium, yeah. What are my perks at again? I was spending my time leveling. Uh, I prestiged again, so my perks are back. Not that great. Yeah, I guess I'll put on hard. I want to make it too difficult. I want this to just be a little relaxing. Rather underwhelming. Rather uh, uh, underwhelming. To, to say the least. I really wish I had stream chat on, but it's not on. Oh well. Oh well. Stream thing still coming in? I don't know if I have the new chat, though. Store it and put this one in. I got a bit distracted. I got a bit distracted. Let me update this one. It's kind of big. You won't be able to see everything on screen because of just how fucking how fucking weird uh, the chat is on this. But eh, hopefully, hopefully you can see it just fine. The ship is not in great shape, and I'm pretty sure some Zeds are already on board. But no, oh, well. What perk should I play? I don't really want to do Gunslinger. That's the one I do the most. I'll do Zerk. Zerk's always fun. I've always been a pretty big fan of Killing Floor back whenever I found it. So many years ago. I don't really get to play it much with people. I'm a little rusty myself. But basically, the entire idea is that it's just a, it's just a, a PVE. I know there's a versus mode to it, but it's very unbalanced from what I've heard, and I've never really played it with people. I 
I really wish I could see the chat, but chat doesn't really go crazy with stuff. So I guess it doesn't really matter. I waited for him to show up. This is still more entertaining just sitting here. He can't he cannot blame me for this. He he basically ruined the stream. Told him the time and everything. I gave him central because I didn't really know what fucking part of the world is in. I gotta keep that. I need that. I need to wait on the trader. I'm fine on this. Skip ahead. All the machines. Ah, oh, okay. Where's the thing at? Is that just for, oh, that's just for the trader. Where the hell is the machine at? There's a husk. Get the fuck out of here. Weak. Get out of here. It's been a while. I don't really... I don't really, uh... I have most of the achievements for this game. For the survival shit. I don't really have to worry too much about... Uh, fucking getting all the achievements. God damn it. Get away from me. I guess I should explain the the story for this game. Uh, Mad Scientist creates a bunch of armies of fucking mutant clones or whatever. And he basically plans on taking over the world. It's basically the story. Not super epic, but hey. Yeah, it's something. I really wish I had something to say, but I've never really streamed uh, playing games shit. Ooh, a free weapon. Where the hell's the pod? Here we go. I'm not. I'm not really used to providing commentary live. Games that I play, usually I play them pretty silently. Oh well. Still beats you know, the other one. Keep that. I'm good on all this. There's a whole bunch of different perks you can pick from. I mostly just stick to... I got my favorites because some of them are a lot better than others. Because in the, in the original Killing Floor, there were only, I think, uh, five perks until they added demolitions. So there's six of them from the, uh, from the original. A whole bunch of newer ones. Some of them are reworked. Some of like shittier versions of already good ones. Yeah. Which is pretty weird. I mean, this game does look pretty good for what it is. I'm not really a graphics aficionado. I'm more into uh, frame rates. Something I always cared for more. It's a new Zed they added. They had a whole bunch of new ones too, but some of the just like different kind of variants. Like all of these ones, this one that's spazzing out, that's a slasher. They just deal more damage than the normal uh, clots. They're just beeped up and faster. That's a cyst, that's another clot. They're just really weak. There's another cyst. To be easy to kill. Another cyst. That's an alpha clot. It's just the middle ground. On harder difficulties, they come armored. And they're called rioters, and they're fucking annoying. And they're armored. So, eh. I really hope somebody tells SA that because of the shift I work... I'm not really going to be able to stream a whole lot longer. I mean, hell, this game is going to be close to being uh, finished anyway. So. And I can't see chat, neither. Because I don't have that set up properly. So it's awkward because I can't see what people are saying. 
It's not on screen for me. In OBS, you can see it because it's just the settings or whatever, but... And I know there are ones for, uh... For NVIDIA. For a shadow play, that let you see it, but I don't have that tinkered because I wasn't really planning on that. I was a little late. It's a little late for that. Oh well. That's, just the beginning, Don't get That's a siren. They destroy your projectiles because they're cunts. There's another slasher. Oh boy, my survivalist perk got level 2. The worst perk in the game. I wish the survivalist perk was better. That's a stalker. They're invisible. There's another alpha clot. Resist. That's a crawler. That's a Gorefast. That's a Scrake. They're fucking annoying. Not really that bad to kill. Just gotta kill everything else around them. And then just kinda clean them up later. Cause if you piss them off, they uh... They run at you. You can't outrun them and they do a lot of damage. But they're not that hard to kill if you isolate them. That's a Bloat. They explode. Cover you in acid. Kinda like the Boomer. From Left 4 Dead. Right now I'm using the uh, Vlad the Impaler. And it's just a nail gun. Just to show you. You do enough damage to him to get pissed off and they charge at you. Eh, I don't really know if I want to switch to a different weapon yet. I'll drop that one. Let's see. I use the static strikers. I don't use those very much. They're actually pretty good. Let's get the trader. I'm ready. On their way. Go show them how we treat turnstile jumpers. Objectives. Usually when I play this map, I usually try to just hold out here. I mostly just play solo. This is supposed to be more of a team-oriented game, but... Playing it solo, I just find it... I just find it more fun just being a one-man army against bots. It's not like it's not like TF2's uh, Man vs. Machine where you can't really play it alone. You could, theoretically, but no. Oh, these guys are quarter pounds. They're like little tiny versions of flesh pounds. Using strong attacks. I'm supposed to be parrying their attacks. It's one dead. There is one thing I fucking, uh... I really like about... really like about this. Is that originally when I... Because I used to play Killing Floor back in the day, and the Flesh Pounds were outrageous. For all perks aside from Medics and uh, Zerkers, which is just Berserker, which is what I am, uh, they could basically one-shot you with a fully uh, raged hit. It's really fucking annoying to deal with, especially if you're playing solo. Damn it, I fucked the timing on that one up. There we go. Probably after this, I guess I might just hop in and talk to SA anyway, but... Give him time to be ready, I guess. My voice is kind of worn out. From dead air. So... Nah. I'll take a moment to, like, read the chat a little bit. Cause I know, I know he's DMing me. I know he's DMing me about shit. Yeah, I know, I can see his DMs. I can see it. I fucking waited for him, told him the time and everything, didn't show up. Why should I fuck up my sleep schedule just for some other guy I don't even like? But okay. Alright then. I guess when this is over, I'll come and talk to him. I'm sure he's watching this, or listening. What is it, wave six? There's only two more. So. 
And I say there's two more because after you get through with all seven waves, you have to fight a boss. Fuck away from me. Where the hell's that doodad I need to fix? I see there's a stalker. This fucker. Pair this a little bit. Here we go. Sometimes that time really fucks with me. It's kind of cool, but eh. it's only really useful for playing like Commando, which is mostly just assault rifle weapons. Still a pretty good perk, though. It's annoying fucking crawlers. I do like how they reinvented the melee combat for this. I do like that. Fuck away from me. Come on. Whenever you hit him with attack like that, it usually just disables them for a little bit. I see there's a crawler there. Oh shit, that's a flesh pound. Let me heal up real quick. Let me parry their attacks a little bit. Do as much damage. I'll back a little bit. Damn it, hold still. There we go. Got him. Well, I didn't repair it, but no well, no matter. Don't worry, I said this earlier. I guess we'll do our stream then. I'm not going to spend a whole lot of time on it. I want to switch weapons. Eh, I think I might switch. I do love the Ion Thruster. It's a decent weapon. One of the DLC ones. I was actually disappointed that they added DLC weapons anyway. Because the first one, they had a bunch of DLC and shit. But whatever. Hey, free weapon. Shut up, cat. This one off. Fight this wave. Fight the boss. I'll switch perks to something else that's more boss-oriented, because... Finding a boss with melee weapons is a pain in the ass. Especially if I get the abomination. Just a beefed-up bloat. So I should explain some of the other bosses, too. So, of course, there's the Patriarch who's still here from the first game. But he's a little bit different. There's Hans. Originally, whenever they started developing Killing Floor 2, the only boss they had was Hans. And he's mostly, like... He's mostly gun-oriented. He sort of... Like, every, every boss has, like, melee and... Fucking range stuff, but his is mostly gun. Fuck out of here. These are Edars, by the way. They're fucking annoying. Everybody hated them when they first came out in this game. It was one of them. Had a lot of health, hard to kill. They, you can't get headshots like most of the other, uh, most of the other enemies. These guys out, they're still easier to deal with than normal flesh pounds. For one, they don't block their chests. That little light's a weakness of theirs. I didn't know that for a long time until I saw a guy was like, Oh, that makes sense, and I just used special attack. Oops. So this is basically the last, almost the last wave. So don't worry. This isn't very long. Let's see, what perk do I want to be? I'm going to swap to Gunslinger. Gunslinger's like my go-to perk. I don't really try to use it that much. Let's see. That one. Okay. I'm ready. I don't know which boss it's going to be. It's random. There's like five different bosses it could be. Who is it going to be? Oh, it's the Patriarch. 
I'll be honest, when I first played this and I saw the the update for the Patriarch, because he was the second boss they added into this game. I don't know where he is. I think he's coming out from the back. Oh shit, there he is, never mind. He's right in front of me. He fights mostly the same as he did in the first one. The only difference is, is that he fucking, uh... He heals a little bit differently. Because if you are fast enough... Like right now he's fleeing, he's running away. And he spawns a bunch of his little shits to come and fight me. I don't know where he's at. You're supposed to try to chase him down and kill him early. But he's very hard to catch up to. Unfortunately. So I'm not really going to bother. I'm still kind of playing safe. Yes, I can see it on the corner. I know he wants to get my attention, but... He kind of fucked it up a little bit. I told- I'm t oh, look, I'm saying this, like, right now, I know he wants my attention. I was trying to get his attention earlier. Guess he was asleep. But whatever. I will come and talk to him when this is over. He can't call me a fucking brainlet, because I already gave him a time and everything. Oh, shit. <laughs> gave him a time and everything. Hope he's hearing this. Just let him run off. Find some more ammo. I could run dry very easily. These are automatic weapons, after all. It's very easy to do that. I'm good on ammo. I can't see... Ch and it should be noted, I can't see chat, neither. Because I don't have that set up to see chat while I'm playing games. So. I don't have a dual monitor neither. So I know he's trying to get my attention. And yes, I'll talk to him when this is over. There he is. I'm not even playing on that hard of a difficulty anyway. So he was gonna, he's going to die very quickly. This isn't even a very long game. I didn't want to do one that was too short. Shit! There we go. Come on. Hate how he fucking goes invisible, though. There he goes. Okay, he's healing for the last time. I don't know where he's at, though. Clean up his fuck trashes and I'll be out of here. I don't think he heals fully on the third one, or the last one. He heals himself, like, three times. Which is what makes his fight so fucking annoying, but... Whatever. He hasn't healed yet. There he goes. He doesn't have a whole lot of health. There he is. I see him. Okay, I'll kill him real fast. I'll end this stream and I guess we'll talk. Get the fuck out of here. Ugh. Come on. Come on. Oh, fuck. I didn't know he could actually do that. There he goes. He's dead. Okay. Yay. He's dead. So I guess I'll talk to SA now. Didn't really plan on... <laughs> didn't really plan on him showing up this late. Whatever. Maybe I can spend this time to improve my gaming stuff later. I'm not voting on a map, I'm leaving. Collect this money and go. Add it to me, Vault. Change the stream over. And uh, go talk to him, I guess. Looks like that's pretty much over. So, okay.